Studies show nationwide there's a shortage when it comes to teachers. I'm Melissa Wright, your North Omaha neighborhood reporter at 24th and Paul Street, where One Early Education Center is looking to show appreciation to teachers. Is it carrots? <laughs> I love the kids. I love my coworkers, but I really love the kids. I love to see the journey. Teresa Dodds has been in the industry for 20 years. Started off as a sub and a teacher A and then an associate teacher and I've been working on my bachelor's also. Dodds says this job is her calling and she hopes to make a difference for many children. Not only as I'm getting to see the kids growth, I get to see the parents grow. Don Olichnik, the development director at Educare Omaha, says this week is all about appreciating teachers through lunches, goodie bags, coffee trucks, and even written letters from parents. We appreciate them every day of the year. Um, it's through, um, you know, the interactions with one another. Olijnik says with early education having a high turnover rate, they're always looking to recruit. It's a paid internship where they get to experience what the classroom is like, um, be paired with an experienced teacher to coach them and teach them along the way. Stats show at UNO students are still taking interest in becoming educators. In 2024 in total, UNO has 224 graduates earning a degree in education. That's compared to 208 in the 2019 to 2020 school year. Bennington Public Schools are always looking to recruit new teachers, especially through special programs. Stacy Hahn tells me. Whether they are brand new out of college or a veteran teacher that has just switched jobs and moved to now being in Bennington is our mentor mentee program. We have focused really hard on building that program. Studies show in Nebraska a lack of early learning education options essentially play a role in the economy. 74% say not having access to child care makes it harder for Nebraska businesses to hire new employees and to grow. At 24th and Paul, I'm Melissa Wright, your North Omaha neighborhood reporter.